Now, am I the only one that thinks that Chaos has a very smug aesthetic? Like, his entire aesthetic, like, his personality is just very smug and condescending, and I don't think I'm with that. <laughs> Even though I just explained my entire personality, but that's fine. All right, here we go. Hipster going in with some phenomenal moves as he just immediately puts Koma half b below his health. All right, here we go. Koma finally get, taking his turn back, getting some nice corner pressure. CSs gets a gets a gold throw and is able to break his opponent and summoning his Pokemon, locking them down. Ooh, with the force function from the from the uh, grand thrust, divine thrust, that's what it's called. And CS is right after to try and go right back in. And again, with that assault B, people need to be aware of that assault B, because. I wouldn't say it comes out fast, but it, it, it it's got some speed to it. Like, I'm not going to sit here and lie, I don't have speed to it, but I feel as though people get caught by that way too much. All right, with some, stack, with some staggered low pressure, Koma finally opens him up. He's finally starting to block with Assault B. is good, good. Gets hit with a third... Well, yeah, gets hit with a third 2A. And with Koma sitting at 200 meter, Verbal and a Plether, a Grid. Oh, he tries to go for a veil off and it just didn't work. I believe he should have held onto it a bit more. Ooh, that had to hurt just a bit. EX summons Ozzy to try to pull this game back out of the out of the grips of defeat. Guard thrust to put his opponent back out of this out of this face to reset neutral. What is with the range on that divine thrust? That was like almost darn near the whole entire screen. Like, yo, someone explain this to me. That was wild. <laughs> and just like that, Koma puts a number on the board. Wow, that actually went by pretty fast. <laughs> like, jeez. But you know what happens? Oh boy, we got Lene plays. Let's go, my guy Hipster. My guy Hipster is going with Lene. And we're going with the Gordo and Chaos BGM. That's good, that's good, that's good. All right, so let's see if good old Lene has a better chance up against Master Koma's Orie. All right, we got some good oh, cause, cause, drop combos, but that's fine. It happens. Everyone gets one. See, look at the range on Orie's Reaper. I don't like it, and I'm not with it at all. Koma putting his opponent in the corner, sitting at a good nice 10% from his Volvo and just increasing his grid. So once he CSs, he's going to get a good amount of, what you call it, meter back. Yeah, that's the word. And there we go with the CS, which also allows him to reset his pressure. Ooh, good CS with the DP to challenge Koma to get out of the corner. But again, with that Assault B, puts him right back in the corner. And with the route he just picked, he drops, but that's fine because CSs. And with just the second or third 2A, he's able to get his opponent open and take home the match, allowing him to go in with 200 meter into the next match. Oh, and this is also our Losers Finals. So this is going to be a good three out of five. All right, EX summons the Persona, so let's see what he can do. Him just able to block all the mix-ups, and ooh, with the frame advantage of, the, of just his, the lag behind that attack from Lene, that just opened up Hipster to lose that match, and that just had to hurt. Like, I don't, whew. Like, it was actually pretty ridiculous how, how slow and laggy, I guess, the recovery frames on that attack from Lene was. I felt it was like two or three seconds passed. That which gave Koma plenty of time to go in and just say 2 0. <laughs> like, you. You. But like I said, and, <laughs> and just like that, Hips just is like, no. I tried my pocket, it didn't work. We're going back to main. It's fine. I'm not even mad at you. You gave it a shot, and that's okay. So, going into, with our losers finals, it is Koma. The numbers, on the, the numbers on the top are wrong, I believe. Yeah, they're definitely wrong. It's 2-0, two, it's two Koma's favor. All right, Hipsters, definitely showing, still showing some fight in them. I didn't know Ori says, do they all say chain shift like that? That was the first time I heard Ori say that. That's pretty wild. All right, Hipster, Hipster's showing some phenomenal fight in him. He definitely might be the underdog in this fight right now. Well, definitely he's the underdog in this fight right now. Who am I even saying? 
All right, and with a phenomenal life lead with 50 seconds left on the clock, Com uh, Hipster has Como right where he wants him. But you drop the combo. No, what are you doing, my friend? You put him at that magic pixel again. Hipster, I swear, don't do this to me, yo. Please, please, like, my heart can't take it. Like, you know Koma has to go in with 30 seconds left on the clock. Like, CS's after the Divine Thrust gets the nice low starters, and he begins his onslaught. And he has 200 meter, gets the grab with 20 seconds left on the clock, gets the lockdown with the persona. He force functions out. Good on you. Oh, my goodness. Call Hipster, please. Like, I know he Yo, this is not happening. This is not happening. Koma's about to, with seven seconds left on the clock, with the with this EX. Oh, my goodness. Too much with the... <gasps> I'm done. I can't. That, no. Oh, my goodness. That You put him at that magic pixel, and Koma just ran that back on you. I, mm, I wouldn't even want to play anymore. I'm sorry. Like, that's just me. I'd be like, you know what? You got it. Koma, you got it. I don't want to play you anymore. Like, yo, get away from me, you bully. Like, no. Oh, man. All right. Uh, if, Co if Como wins his next one, he moves on to Grand Finals, which we'll be seeing Ray once more. Gets Hipster goes in with the Veil Off, which is going to shatter Como's grid. And then Como finally sees, well, not finally, but sees some daylight once more. Converts. Drop, but continues his turn. Gets the low. Tries to go for a jump B, but he immediately hits by, by the Garth Rust from Hipster. Ooh, this is just, this is just not looking good for Hipster right now, folks. Mm. With the reflector, he tries to get the wall bounce. Ooh, and Jesus, and with that grand divine thrust from downtown, it's like Seth Curry throwing a freaking three from the from the from the 